Sega Drunk. Hello and welcome to my new series, SNES Drunks Oh My God Look at This Fucking Game Stop Wasting Time Watching This Video and Go Play This Right Now series. The games that belong in this category so far include Contra 3, Intrusion 2, Gigantic Army, and now Gunstar Heroes. Here's the part where I highly recommend you stop wasting time watching this video and go play Gunstar Heroes right now! Because I mean, what is the point of a review of something like this? What can you say about this game? Well, I've got some time to fill here, so I'll talk about it anyway. Gunstar Heroes is freaking spectacular in every aspect. Visually, it looks incredible. The soundtrack fits perfectly, the controls are flawless, the weapons are a lot of fun, the level design fits your numerous capabilities perfectly, the bosses are just awe-inspiring. I mean, look at this thing. I get distracted just watching how freaking cool this boss is and end up dying once or twice. Oh, and did I mention you can make lots of stuff go boom? Because you can make lots of stuff go boom. And it's also two players. How can you beat that? The weapon system is especially fun because you can grab two out of a possible four weapons, laser, flamethrower, homing, and rapid fire. You can hold two at a time, toggle one from another, and you can also play with combinations, so you essentially have 14 total weapons. My favorite is the homing flame, so freaking cool. This isn't your only method of dishing out punishment though, you can also throw enemies into one another, just like a beat-em-up game. To start the game you get four stages to choose from, Mega Man style, and these stages are long that range all over the place in all sorts of environments. This stage and employs the Metal Storm mechanic of flipping from the ceiling to the floor as you're swarmed with enemies from all directions. This boss fight has you fighting on a plane mid-flight, and there's even a shoot-em-up level that's well done. Another thing that helps set Gunstar Heroes apart from other run-and-gun games is that this isn't a one-hit death kind of a deal like Contra. Your life meter is represented in numbers, hit zero and you're dead, and you have to start at the beginning of the level. That's fair, especially since there's unlimited continues. Anyway, why are you still watching this video? Go play Gunstar Heroes. It's available on Sega Genesis, the Wii Virtual Console, PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, and all sorts of other platforms. This is easily a top five Genesis game, and I dare say it's better than Contra 3. Go play it.